Welcome to my video. Shave and a haircut. You're damn good. But I want to get in this quick little video. Hell yeah for ya. Oh yeah. Hey, yo. I got in this video for ya. So today's video is plain. This first video for women's health and men's health sexually. First of all, ladies, I want you to understand something. Let, you, let your man shave down there. Or be very gentle if you shave in his testicles. But ladies, first of all, just by that, uh, washing and cleaning in your sexual holes or sexual testicles for guys is very important. That's how STDs get spread. And the ladies, hairy, hey, the YouTube allows it. Hairy pussy is okay. It's okay. Just as long as you shave, you can shave it just a little bit. Okay, to leave a this a little bit, cause, but just not in the way you taste. It tastes like hair, but just you know, mild ladies if you're sensitive. But most of all, ladies, you should. If you want a one sure way, but I will tell. If a man doesn't shave and has too much hair around his testicles, ladies, that's not a man you sleep with. We might think it's manly, but it ain't. Nothing wrong with a little hair that is shaved back where it's still hair, but not an overabundance of hair, okay? Because you don't want an overabundance of hair. Guys, if you want to protect yourself and your woman, or your date, or your girlfriend, your lover, your sexual playmate, when you shave, gently shave. Don't go. I use sensitive skin razor blades, and I use shaving cream, and I moisten my blade, and I go gently. When I say gently, I don't do wear bloodletting. I go gently, gently. So, but it's very important that you do that, or else what happens is that's how ticks, how you get trans, you pass diseases. And when you wash down there, when you clear some of the hair, when you wash, you clear out bacteria when you shower and bathe. With, for men, if you haven't, you should you should be showering and bathing two, two or three times a, day, a week. You really should. After you have, you screw and have, you fuck and have sex, you should be taking a shower or thing afterwards. You get back, you should take another one. Watch her perfume off you. Watch any bacteria. You really should be doing these things for your health. And last, and now I want to tell you a little bonus tip. For anybody who, for teenage boys and all this thing, when you sneak in the, in the girl's room and have cookie sex, running on a lawn in your underwear invites ticks and when ticks get in there, ticks spread Lyme disease and you can infect your little girlfriend. So very important, wash and take care. Thanks.